Justin has a bucket, a straw, and a donut. How can he escape? I would have my friend the Thick Shark eat me whole. <laughs> Adam is skydiving, but his parachute won't open. What should he do? If I was skydiving, I saw this guy coming towards me. I'm <laughs> now she has these three pills. She can only take one. What should she do to get to safety? Are you actually troll? <laughs> What is up, guys? Welcome to this episode of Lanky Box. Yeah! Today, we are seeing if Justin can solve some messed up mystery riddles. Justin will now be showing several different riddles. If he can guess the answer to most of them correctly, he gets to play a special game with prizes at the end. Let's go. Okay, Justin, let's see how many of these riddles you can get right, guys. Play along and see if you can beat Justin. And as you guys know, we have an iPhone giveaway going what? on right now. And it's so easy to enter. All you have to do is be subscribed to this channel. What? Yeah, just turn on notifications and just be subscribed to Lanky Box. That's literally it. I've entered. I've <laughs> entered in, this, in the giveaway. You're subscribed to us. And, and I got Cookie <laughs> Jimmy to subscribe as well. <laughs> like, we got three chances here. Okay, yeah. so guys, make sure to enter. Just hit subscribe, turn on notifications. That's literally it. And let's get into the first messed up mystery riddle right now, which is this Justin riddle. What? Okay, Justin is in a room <laughs> where water is pouring <laughs> in. Stop. There's no way to get out or turn it off. He'll be rescued in five minutes. Five minutes. I yeah. can do that. Justin has a bucket, a straw, and a donut. How can he escape? That's too easy, Adam. It's way too easy. <laughs> okay, I got a bucket, I got some donuts, and I got a straw. Okay, the water's coming in. What are you gonna do? I would open my donut. Oh, yeah. These are fresh. Yeah. <laughs> the water's coming. I don't care. <laughs> and then I would eat my donuts. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> the water is still coming. And then I would take my straw and I would sip on the water. <laughs> That's it, I'm done. I'll wait five minutes. No, the water's still filling up. Eventually, it's gonna fill up the entire room. Are you sure? Yeah. In five minutes? Yeah. That's not possible. Yeah. Uh, well, if it did, I would call in a friend. Oh, it's <laughs> the thick shark. I would have my friend the thick shark eat me whole. <laughs> <laughs> and I would just survive in his tummy for five minutes. You haven't even touched the bucket. That's your third object that you have. I mean, let me think this through. I got it. Really? I got it. I got it. I would use the straw and the donuts to build a one-of-a-kind snorkeling device. Really? Yes, wherein I could breathe out of this side and eat donuts out of the other. <laughs> 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 Is this what you did when you were a lifeguard? <laughs> oh, I actually, I actually got some. Really? Yeah, that's what I would do. And then, oh, wait. I got an idea, Adam. What? If I put the bucket over my head, uh -huh. there's air in here. Okay. I could just breathe this air. <laughs> I would breathe the air under the bucket for five minutes, or I would make a snorkel out of my donuts and straw. Done. I need you to select one of those two options. I'll give you a hint. You're really close. Am I really? Yeah. You just need to pick which of those two options you think is more viable. Guys, let us know what you think Justin should do. Can you figure this out? I'm gonna give you five seconds. Five, four. I would take the bucket. And I put it on your head. Wow. And then I'm gonna lock in the donut snorkel. Justin. Do you think this is the answer? <laughs> Okay, Justin's gonna lock in, make a snorkel no, out of no, the donut. No, no, I'm locking the bucket. I'm locking the bucket. <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah. Justin is going to, are you sure? Yeah. Justin is going to lock in, putting the bucket over his head. Let's see what the answer is. Turn the bucket upside down. It will create a pocket of air. Uh -huh. Justin got that one right. Now I also have a bucket based riddle what? that I'm gonna put at the end of this video and see if people can solve. Okay. So watch the full video if you guys wanna try and solve that, but we're gonna get into the next riddle right now, which is this survival riddle. Oh, oh okay. Please. Now this one is a little scary. Adam is skydiving, but his parachute won't open. You put yourself in a riddle, really? Yeah. Okay. You have always wanted to skydive. What should he do? Now, your three options are, I could either curl in a ball in the air, I could cling on to another skydiver, or I could open the reserve parachute and hope that works. Those are the only three options? Those are the only 
only three options. Curl in a ball, cling on to another skydiver, or open the reserve parachute. <laughs> Is this just an actual safety question? I don't know. I don't skydive. <laughs> Recreational. <laughs> curl in a ball is like what the real Adam would do. Well, if I curled in a ball and I fell and hit the ground, I just bounce back up. Cling on to another skydiver. That's not a good idea. Why? Because who would let you do that? <laughs> if I was skydiving, I saw this guy coming toward me. <laughs> it's gotta be C. Open the reserve parachute. What? How would any other answer possibly make sense? Are you trolling? Is there something I'm missing here? Just is gonna lock in. Is open the, the is reserve this parachute. Is the, is the next riddle gonna be in a fire? What should you do? Stop, drop, and roll? Is the, the answer? answer is if you cling to another skydiver, you'll kill them too. Yeah. So that's not the option. Yeah. Curling in a ball isn't a guaranteed survival. Yeah. So go with the reserve parachute. Wait, what? That tested your survival <laughs> instincts. How is that a riddle? Are you trolling? It's to test your survival skills. That's not a test of your survival yeah. skills. Yeah. Jesse got that one right. We're gonna get into the next riddle right now, which is this forest riddle. A girl and her friend were walking in a forest. <laughs> okay, okay. One of them got lost. Oh, no. However, she had three magic pills in her pocket. Is this another pill <laughs> question? She can only take one pill. Okay. The green pill gives her super hearing. Uh, okay. The red pill gives you super speed. Okay. Okay. <laughs> the purple pill gives you night vision. Okay. What should she do to get to safety? That's it? So she's in the forest. She has a friend, right? But uh -huh. she got lost. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Now she has these three pills. She can uh -huh. only take one. Uh -huh. How can she get to safety? Okay. <laughs> Too easy. Really? Because I have magic pills right here. Yeah. No, those are Skittles. Nope. That's just candy. Nope. These are prescription. Your doctor gave you those? Oh, yeah. For what illness? <laughs> <laughs> you know, to get more things. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so she's got a green pill that gives her, what, super hearing? Right. The red one gives her super speed. Yeah. And the purple one gives her better eyesight. It gives her night vision because where she is, it's really dark. She can't see anything. She's in a forest? Okay. Yeah. Now, the first question I have is, what does the friend have to do with this? Maybe it has to do with her getting to safety. So let's say me and you were walking in a forest and you got lost and you knew that I was somewhere in the forest. Which pill would you take? <laughs> if we were lost in a forest together? I, I bet you'd take the speed pill and run the opposite direction of me. I would take all the skittles <laughs> and eat them myself. No, that's against the rule. Why? It says you can only take one pill. The green one gonna help her hearing. I don't really see how that helps. Although maybe she could take it and she could listen and hear sounds of civilization and know which way to go. Super speed. That also seems useful because she just run in any direction and see if there's people over there. And if there's not, she'd come back super fast. I wouldn't take the purple one. The purple one's the worst. It's not dark out, just a forest. Why do I need to see in the dark? Because there's no lighting in a forest. Yes, the, what do you mean there's no light? in a forest. It never said it's nighttime. Okay. Yeah, I can take the purple one and not even use it. Okay. Yeah, don't need it. Now I have two options. Okay. The nice green pill to give me supersonic hearing. I don't really think that's useful. I'm taking the green one. I'm getting rid of it. It's the super speed pill. Duh. How would Justin get out of the forest? Let us know what you guys think. The answer is she can't see her friend through the tree. What are you talking What For the running one. What? She wouldn't know where to run. What? 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 It's dark out. What does her friend have to do with any of this? Her friend is her ticket to safety. Why? Because they're together. You would just leave your friend to die. So it's not the running pill. She should pick the super hearing pill. Why? Because she can hear her friend. Why do you keep talking about her friend? She's still lost. Yeah, but at least they're together. What are you talking about, Adam. They're lost together. They're gonna die together in the forest because she didn't take no, the red pill. No, one of the girls went off into the forest and got lost. Uh -huh. The other girl is still safe. A what? A girl and a friend were walking in the forest. Look at how happy they were. One of the girls got lost. They're both lost. Are you <laughs> Are you trolling? I think Justin's a little upset because he got outsmarted. <laughs> Justin got that one wrong. And we're going on to the next riddle right now, which is this connect the dot riddle. Huh? All you got to do is connect the four dots using three straight lines. Okay, connect the four dots. No, oh, Justin, oh, oh, oh. no. 
phone. Why? Yeah, not on the phone. Why? Boom, boom, no. boom, boom. Why? I'm drawing on my phone. Use paper. Uh -huh. Okay, so see if you guys can figure this one out. There's four dots, right? Yeah. You need to use three straight lines and connect all four of them. Did I already figure it out? No. What are you talking about? Three lines to connect them? Yeah. One, two, three. No, are these aren't connected. Oh, you have to connect all of them? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let me think. Three straight lines Correct. to connect them? Yes. Okay. Uh, it's a tricky one. I need you to use 100% of your brain. One? Okay. What is so funny? <laughs> what is so funny? No, keep going. One, two, three. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but these aren't connected. These aren't connected. And these aren't connected. And these aren't connected. <laughs> <laughs> but you did make a really cute fish. Wait, hold on. <laughs> hold on, hold on. I got four dots right here. I gotta connect them with three lines. Yes, three straight lines. Okay. Will you give me a hint if I get one of the lines right? No. What? I'll give you a donut if you get one right. No, Justin! What? Stop drawing on the phone. Try and figure this out. Think outside the box. How did I know you were gonna say something cringe like that? Think outside the box. Mm -hmm. So I gotta do something like this, like outside the box. You're thinking a little too square. Maybe try another shape. That's the last hint I'm gonna give. No, that's not a straight line. <laughs> and you missed one of them. Okay, it's not a circle. It could be a triangle. How many lines are you allowed to have? Three. How many shapes have three lines? What is this, the SAT? <laughs> I'm a trying, triangle. I'm trying to help you. It's a triangle. Okay. How does that help? Are you trolling? I have already said too much. What is a right triangle? What is like this? Huh? You uh, just connected! How was that the answer? Wait, 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 Are wait, wait. Are you trolling? You must be trolling. I really hope you're trolling. How was that any different than what I did about 10 minutes ago, which is this? They're all connected. That's actually the answer? You just trolled me and everybody at home for a solid 10 minutes. Is this the answer? Yeah. Are you are you actually trolling? <laughs> I was closer when I did this. <laughs> that's like this. That's only two lines, and now they're all connected. No, these are connected. Yes, they are. That's a connection. Chimmy says, get in. I am math professor Chimmy. You go where you belong. In the trash, yeah. I'm gonna say you got that one right. Yeah! Okay, Jossie got that one right, and we're gonna the next riddle right now, which is this mistake riddle. Okay. Okay, can you spot a mistake here? Okay, so it's <laughs> one through nine. There's yeah. different colors. You gotta figure out where is the problem. Can you spot a mistake here? So it's red, green, purple, yellow, blue, green, purple, brown, red, right? Yeah. Could you see a mistake? Adam. Why you got it? insult my intelligence. <laughs> what? Can you spot a mistake here? Yeah. You're trying to throw me off, Adam. How? Trying to convince me it's the colors. Red, green, purple, yellow, blue, green, purple, brown, red. Little do you know, Adam, I am a math professor and also a grammar professor. Cookie has solved it. What is it? It's right there. What? Cookie says, why don't you take a closer look? I can't see it. Can Justin! Ah! Justin! Oh, look, there's two black spots in there right now, Adam. I don't know. The answer is the word spot. What do you mean? There's two spots. Can you spot spot a mistake here? Okay. That has nothing to do with numbers or colors. You tried to trick us. Okay, just think it's the word spot. And he is correct. The word spot was there twice. Wow. I'm surprised you got that. Okay, let us know if you guys were able to spot that riddle. He wins and he gets to spin the wheel. Let's see what his prize is. Comment below some prizes that you want us to have next. Wait, Adam, put your little bucket riddle on the screen. Okay, I'm gonna put it up right now, guys. See if you can solve that and comment below. Okay, let's see what I want. No, that's not a straight line. My friend the think shark. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, okay, nice. nice. Hey, if Justin when he gets a party with Boxy and Chimmy. Okay. okay. Are those the only two people invited? Yeah. Hey, we got no party. one else? We got no one else. You didn't forget to invite anyone? Oh, yeah. Wait, we did forget to invite someone. Who? A very close friend of ours, Adam. <laughs> really? Yeah. Who? The Dick Shark. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs>